Go Country 105. It is Tim Hurley and Adam Bookbinder, and we are talking to Chris Young. Good morning, Chris. Ooh. Good morning. How's it going, guys? Good. We are doing great out here, and we are all losing our minds with how excited we are about this. You are going to be headlining Boots in the Park on June 19th in Norco. Live shows are officially back. Dude, you have no idea how I have got it. <laughs> So as an artist, is the energy a little bit different before a show after taking a year off? I mean, I don't know. That'll be my first one back. Oh, wow. <laughs> what about rehearsals, just general butterflies? How are you feeling? I mean, I, I, everybody always says you get butterflies in your stomach. I don't really get nervous to do a show. Uh, I get more, like, excited. I have to, like, make sure I don't run out there and, like, run across the stage 18 times or run out of breath during the first song. Uh <laughs> But I'm just looking forward to it. I, I'm, I'm really, really excited. How many times has that happened, by the way, where or you're playing at, like, altitude, and you run out on stage, and you lose your breath the first song, <laughs> and it takes you, like, two songs to get back into it? Uh, it doesn't take that long, but it's happened once or twice, where <laughs> I was like, oh, I came out a little too hot. <laughs> <laughs> I think the audience probably appreciates it anyway. Uh, we've been playing your song Famous Friends with Kane Brown a ton. Obviously, it's a smash. Uh, when number one, I know it's a duet, but are you able to add this to your set list? Oh, yeah. I mean, I've played this song on my own quite a bit. Um, you know, the first time that Kane and I actually performed it together was on the ACM Awards. That's so crazy. So I, I was wondering if you're going to do like the Brad Paisley technique where you have a hologram in the background. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we might. You never know. I've done uh, I've done that before with Think of You for uh, the song I did with Cassidy Pope. Oh, I love it. That's actually really fun, isn't it? Oh, Bookbinder's volunteering over here. If you need a, a duet partner, he's all he's available. Oh yeah, it might not sound good, but I'll I'll be there to help. <laughs> as long as you know the words, who cares? <laughs> I, I could. Go. I, the rest of the crowd will be singing along. Oh, We're great. gonna take a quick break, but more with Chris Young in just a few minutes. Go Country 105. This is Tim Hurley and Adam Bookbinder, and we are back with Chris Young. So, Chris, I love your Instagram post from a few weeks ago where you're, well, I guess you're in L.A. And someone All right, I'm going to, I know which one you're talking about. I'm going to, I'm going to tell you guys, I'm going to let you in on the secret. Okay. Um, that was a friend of mine who was at lunch and sent me the video. And so I was like, it doesn't make sense if I try to be like, oh, my friend who's in L.A. sent me a video of this car. So I, I, oh, I kind of did a little. Gotcha. So for those of you who don't know the story, on, on Chris Young's Instagram page, there's a video of a car parked at a corner in Los Angeles, and the tag was, which apparently was just a huge lie, was that he was at lunch <laughs> and overheard somebody in their car playing his song. But it's still got to be pretty cool, even though your friend sent you the video. That's yeah. got to be an awesome feeling. No, it, it's definitely an awesome feeling. You know what the weirdest thing is? Uh, that's on my TikTok as well, and it's it's the most viewed thing I've ever posted, and it's Wow. A video of a car at a stoplight. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That, the highs and lows of being a celebrity right there. <laughs> uh, yeah, I have no idea what, what the algorithm picked up on that, but uh, if it's somebody blasting tomorrow out of their car, why not? Oh, that's yeah, great. <laughs> well, Chris, you seem to love SoCal. Are you going to be able to spend a little time out here? Or are you back to kind of a full tour schedule these days? Uh, I mean, we're not full. Um, obviously, you know, the, for me, I was hoping these shows even happen. Because when I saw him on the calendar, I was like, man, that's June. That might be a little quick. But like you said, uh, shows are back, and, and no one is happier than me. Trust me. So uh, I, I'm actually going to ride the bus out. It's like you know a two-day bus ride. I was like, I don't care. I'm not flying. I want to be on the bus. <laughs> Love it. That's, that's cool. got to be a great feeling, and we couldn't be more excited. Chris Young headlining Boots in the Park at Silver Lakes in Norco on June 19th. Chris, thank you so, so much. I can't talk. Thank you so much for taking the time <laughs> to call in with us. Hey, man, thank you guys so much for getting the word out about the show and also for uh, running Famous Friends up the chart. I know Kane would say the same thing if he was on this call, so uh, we love you. Go Country 105. Go Country 105.